there are two uh, high school students at Gainesville, Gainesville High School in Jacksonville, Florida, that are now apologizing and will no longer attend that high school after they released two racist YouTube videos. Now, the second video that we're about to show you bits and pieces of um, got them in so much trouble. And it's their response to their original video where they said a bunch of racist things against black people. Uh, in their response, they're very defiant. Uh, and I want to give you an example of some of the things that they said in that video. So uh, let's go ahead and start off with the first video where they talk about how uh, black people are in their community. Mm. Okay, first off, let me just say, we go to a large high school. There are about 2,000 students. 60% of them are black. There's like a 10% of like Asian, whatever, blah, 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 all those things. And then there's white people, which is like, I'm not good at math, never mind. Anyway, um, so out of the 60% that are black, 90% um, of the kids that graduate are white, 90% of them. Not a lot of black kids graduate from my school. They they don't like make a living for themselves. They just drop out of high school. They oh, I'm gonna have kids. I'm gonna get a welfare I'm check. I'm gonna get my GED. <laughs> I'll get my on. GED. I'm gonna go work at McDonald's and oh, I'll, if I keep having my babies, Shaniqua, Liko, and Jaquayque, I'll keep getting my welfare check for having my babies. Yeah. Like that is how. Okay, maybe yeah. up north or wherever the hell you people are from, maybe that's not how the black people are. But here, that is where the major. That is how yeah. the majority of them are. Okay, so you get a sense of, uh, you know, their ideas toward the black community. <laughs> yeah, uh, what I'm curious about is why that the girl from Modern Family decided to be part of this video. No, I don't think she looks like her. Are you kidding me? The one no. on the right is the middle girl no. uh, from the Dunphys. The one in the video is way too ugly to even compare to the all one right, from Modern right. Family. Anyway. But anyway, I, look, this isn't to, like, talk about their looks. Like, they're, it, it's... It's amazing how many dumb people are racist, right? Like we did the story about that UCLA student who was hating on the Asians in her in her uh, library or whatever, and she was a complete idiot. Oh, and Jing Chong Ling Long Ting Tong. That was her. That was her. Um, so in this video, it's so funny how she's making fun of students, black students, not graduating high school, and she's like, so like 80% of them are white, and then like, wait, what's the remaining percentage? Uh, I don't know math. Anyway, let's move on. Yeah, and then there's like the Asians, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And You sound real smart, you know. Yeah, well, that's the great irony of this video, right? Talking about how black people are, you know, I guess dumb, uh, they think, as they put out a video to the world showing how racist they are, which is going to get them in so much trouble. Like, you weren't smart enough to figure out, even if you thought these things, that it's not a smart thing to put it out to the world. Oh, they continue. There's irony. Let's watch the second video. Like, why can't they fucking talk right? I, I hate, hate that. that. I hate it. We are talking normal. We talk with very eligible. Eligible. Oh, no. the right word. <laughs> no. That I meant. I meant. <laughs> we are talking with. What is the, the word? The for vernacular. It? That's the way someone talks. Okay. It's like we're clear. Like you can understand what we are saying. Our accents. We use actual words. Black people do not. Like, I'm finna go down to the store, I'm gonna buy this thing, oh girl, oh man, Tyrone, he, what is that? Like, are you stupid? Yes. They oh, yeah. Okay, that uh, they, was awesome though. That was like my favorite part. Yeah, they use uh, words clearly, just in the wrong context. Yeah, <laughs> you know, we're like, uh, you can uh, what kind of understand us because we're eligible. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> All right, it gets better. Let's watch the next one. If you lived here, you would understand. You would not like these black people. That's that's my argument. Like it's where we live. I have been raised around them. It's how it's, they are. It's not even black people themselves. It's, it's the niggers. niggers. Like there's a difference. There's black people. They're fine. They are educated. They go to school. They do what they have to do. Then there's niggers who can't talk right, they keep having kids, they can't get jobs. There's a difference. So uh, they had to go there. Yeah. And God, they're so proud. They're so proud to say that. And what, they're so ignorant, they don't know that this is what people have been saying for decades, for almost centuries here. I mean, you go back to the South in the 1950s, 1920s, they would have said the same exact uh, sentence. You know, there's black people, the good ones, and then there's the 
Right. And uh, look, I, 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 we're not the PC police here. Into, uh, these girls are obviously way over the top. But what I'm saying is, I, I don't want people to think that like there, we think that there isn't a single black person in the country who, you know, uh, sometimes doesn't use the right language or whatever, or you know, drops out of school. It's oh, do those people exist? Of course, they right? exist in every race. It does, you know, right? And, and do they exactly? They also exist in Logan, West Virginia. Absolutely. Do they? And so, and the great irony is that these girls are proving how ignorant white people can be yes. while trying to show how ignorant black people are. Uh, and the problem isn't that, and criticizing some people in the community or asking them to do better. First of all, doing it this way is hideous. Second of all, making assumptions and stereotyping, that's the real problem.